For patients with Parkinson's disease, dopamine replacement helps improve symptoms but does not slow disease progression. Sinpanamab, a human-derived monoclonal antibody that targets aggregated alpha-synuclein, a cytoplasmic protein, has been proposed as a potential disease-modifying therapy. In this Phase II international randomized double-blind trial, 357 patients with early Parkinson's disease were assigned to receive intravenous sinpanamab at a dose of 250, 1250, or 3500 milligrams, or placebo every four weeks for 52 weeks. After this, placebo recipients switched to sinpanamab. The primary endpoints included the change from baseline to weeks 52 and 72 in the total score on the Movement Disorder Society sponsored revision of the Unified Parkinson's Disease Rating Scale, a score that measures motor and non-motor symptoms of Parkinson's disease. At week 52, the change in the Disease Rating Scale score did not differ significantly between any dose of sinpanamab and placebo. The mean score increased by roughly 11 points in all groups, indicating worsening symptoms. Findings at week 72 were consistent with these results. Adverse events were common in all groups and usually mild to moderate in severity. The most common events with sinpanamab included headache, nasopharyngitis, falls, and back pain. The authors conclude that the monoclonal antibody sinpanamab, as compared with placebo, did not slow disease progression in patients with early Parkinson's disease. Full trial results are available at NEJM.org.